a small barge jam-packed with great art. The MS Evoluzzi has dropped anchor here at the Parc de la Villette in Paris. Its cargo hold is filled with sculptures and machines made by Swiss artist Jean Tangli. The Museum Tangli in Basel was founded 25 years ago and has the largest collection of Tangli's works. We're celebrating our anniversary with a ship that takes us to various stages in his career across Europe. The museum ship's centerpiece is this fountain sculpture that's fed with water from the River Seine. Jean Tangli, who died in 1991, was famous for his sculptural machines, known as metamatics. He started making them in the 1950s to criticize society's increasing reliance on automation and technology and became one of the most important representatives of kinetic art. Kinetic art is basically art that moves. Almost all of Tangli's works are motorized and in motion. But he's also an artist who made performance art, one who took his art out onto the street. And that's something we've also made into a main theme with this initiative, with this ship traveling across Europe. Museum Tangli is located in the artist's hometown of Basel. From here, the ship will travel through France, Belgium, the Netherlands and Germany before returning home. Paris is the first stop because it was here that Jean Tangli enjoyed his greatest success. Artist Niki de saint phal who later became his wife, shared his humorous approach to art. He thought that art must go to the people, that it must achieve another kind of relevance. And the way he tried to do that was to create works that appeal to the senses and that can be experienced interactively. As visitors to the exhibition, called Ahoy, can discover firsthand. On the ship, they can go for a swing, make noises and music. It's art that's joyful, with movement and sound. It's something quite fun and out of the ordinary. Normally, you're working in earnest, raising your kids, etc. So these little playful moments where you can take part in a work of art are just magical. This visitor is writing a letter to a complete stranger, a message in a bottle. When the ship reaches its next port of call, the bottle will be opened. She herself has just received this message from a little boy, from Basel. It's sweet. How nice. Another part of the exhibition is taking place at the Pompidou Centre in the heart of Paris. Here, three performances are to bring Jean Tangli's sculptures to life. Man or machine, the artists make music with their bodies. And are transformed into dancing sculptures. For me, the body is also a kind of machine. I think of my body as an instrument, a machine. I don't see the boundaries between one and the other, the differences. Embarking from Paris, the ship will be underway for 10 weeks, bringing smiles to the faces of children and adults along the way.